All right, the first thing we're going to need to do is open the App Store and download the Sports Engine app. Once that's downloaded, you're going to open it and it'll bring you to this screen. And you'll need to put your email address in there and then press go. And then it will ask you to verify your email address. Once you've verified your email address, it's going to ask you to create a Sports Engine account. You'll need to put in your uh, first and last name, and it'll ask you to create a password. I've already done that, so I'm going to just type my password in here. and that will get me into the app. Uh, you'll see across the bottom of the app that there are four icons. The one all the way to the left is your teams. And so go ahead and click on that or it might already be there as the home screen. And there is a blue and white plus button on the bottom right hand corner there. So you're going to click on that and it's going to ask you to search for an existing team or to create a new team. You want to search for an existing team and then type in Heritage Christian Academy and you should see at some point uh, all of our teams pop up. We have Varsity Girls Volleyball, uh, Varsity Girls and Boys Basketball, and the soccer teams are in there at this point. And so for the volleyball team, you're going to go ahead and select varsity girls volleyball and it will ask you if you'd like to favorite this team I would recommend doing so and that way it will be on your home page on the app so if you go ahead and favorite that the star will turn yellow in the top right hand corner I have had a problem with this in the past where it doesn't work but hopefully it works for you if not just say no thanks so you can move on. You'll still be able to find the team. All right, so once you are, once you have your team uh, there, once you found the volleyball page, you can see the schedule, the roster, standings, all sorts of things. Um, we are not using a lot of the things on this app yet because it's new to us. The most important thing for you is the schedule. If you click on the schedule, it'll show you all of our upcoming games. And I think after the games are completed, you'll be able to see past scores and things like that. Uh, you can go into standings and you can see um, past standings for our team and all the other teams in our conference. And uh, then we'll just go along the bottom there. Uh, schedule we've already looked at the chats we're not using at this point and then your account you can uh, you can add in phone number or whatever you'd like to add uh, on your account and that's pretty much it